I'm gonna do it, Jeff. No, don't do it. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna dip him in it. That's cruel. Oh, he hates it so much. Ah. Look at that. No, he loves it. Oh, that does, yeah. He's having fun. We're having fun. Playing Monster Hunter Iceborne. Oh, okay. I yeah. thought that this was like gonna be one of those Steam indie games where it's like hang out at the hot tub and. I, I installed the mod. Okay. To put the clothes back on. Yeah. We're at, we're we're in the hot tub. This is just a foot bath, actually. You want to go check out oh, the hot tub? Okay. Uh, then we pet the cat one more time. Sure. Yeah. Because you can pet the. Okay. All right. Pet the cats now. Yeah. It's a big deal. Look this at seems it. pretty good. Yeah. This is pretty good. Oh. This looks all right. This, yeah, this looks like fun. Believe it or not, we're in a big snowy area, mm -hmm. and uh, th they've got an outdoor, like, hot springs. I'm just gonna dive in with my, with my armor on. Yeah. Here, we can go out here if we want. Look at this. Hot spring. Hot spring? That's hot spring. You might have walked too far. I might have walked too far. Hot spring. Sit down where you are. Yep. Huh. Right, we can take off the armor, though. Okay. I have a little fun. Splash some water. Finally, a dedicated frolic button. <laughs> Ooh. This is good stuff. Yeah. All right, I'm sold. Okay, there you go. End it quickly. Yeah. <laughs> I was sold already. This is... This is the, uh, you know, like an ex expansion to Monster Hunter World. Uh-huh. Um... It's got a whole new roster of, of enemies that they've been, like, doling out in, in various trailers for the past, like, two months. Yeah. So there's not going to be many surprises for people that have been kind of following along. But uh, um, I'll show you around the uh, the Horfrost Reach. This is the brand new area. Mm -hmm. Oops. Talk to me about structure. Is this something that if you were a new player, could you get in here and start with this stuff? Or is it meant for people who have finished? It's definitely meant for people that finish. This is definitely end game content. So okay. traditionally Monster Hunter uh, would release like a brand new game mm -hmm. um, and just call it, you know, like Ultimate or something like that. Uh, and you'd have to pay for, you know, well, the brand new game. But you start from scratch. Sometimes you can transfer your character over, but it's definitely meant for end game content. They, they usually refer to it as G rank. Right. And here they're calling it Master Rank. So you you need to be able to, uh, or you have to be at like level 16, mm -hmm. your hunter rank, which is basically right after like the main story. It's it, it's not that hard to get in, to get through it. Right. I um, think that's probably right around the spot where I was when I stopped. Well, perfect. There you go. So you should be able to hop into to this stuff. It'll start, you know, some brand new cutscenes. you know, a new monster appears, you follow it over to this, this island, and then shit gets cold. Mm -hmm. And then loading times yeah does it have a, a full uh story and cutscenes? you know like yeah, the, yeah, the every, same way the the yeah, base game did yep yeah they bring back uh, some old characters and stuff uh like uh the explorer the lady, old lady mm -hmm. um she's a she's a big part of it uh you get you get some more info about your handler um yeah that goes pretty deep all right all right this is the steamworks thing i don't know what this is exactly. This is like some weird mini game where I can like feed it some of my unwanted stuff. Let's let's give it like let's give it a hundred of these guys. It's a lot. Let's do it. I've got two hundred and ninety-one though. It's still a lot. Well, all right. Uh, oh. You'll get more. There we go. Let's let's help the steam works. All right, we're gonna start, start it. Start up. So they want you to hit these buttons in like a sequence. If you guess it right, then you get much, much more. But if you don't want to deal with it, you can just hold down R2 and it'll kind of automatically do it for you. So what I'm doing here is actually I'm getting items. See over on the left oh, there? Yeah, yeah. Which, okay. is, which is kind of cool. So you're, you're converting ore into items. Some of the items seem good. Right. Yeah, totally. Like Mega Nutrius yeah. and stuff. Yeah, armor spheres. Oh shit! Uh oh. Oh god! It's gonna blow! No, yeah, uh, uh, I'm getting out of the desk. <laughs> well, no wonder it was acting up. Oh, was she's happy too. Cats in the machine. Oh. Well, this is ridiculous. This is absolutely. I don't. Ridiculous. I come to Monster Hunter World for serious. <laughs> I don't. I don't like this. That was always something that I was fun. worried about when they first showed off Monster Hunter World. Is that you know we were hoping it. You know, it was gonna keep some of the old charm and right. you know, goofy shit. Oh, yeah. They definitely. They definitely kept that up. Uh, you've blown up the Steamworks. I think that's a good thing. I don't I don't know. Everybody seems super happy about it. Though. Yeah. 
Well, except for that old guy right now. Yeah, well. So now we can get a shit ton of stuff. All right, off we go again. I may have kind of queued that up just for this quick look. Well, wow. look at all that stuff. Ooh, yeah, sturdy lights. I could probably use that in my house. Hmm. Get it. I get a brand new house. Oh. It's nice. We got a new chief. Remember that guy? Okay. Yeah. yeah he's a chief over in Celiana. That's the name of this, this mm. place. Um, ooh, I, I captured a Glavinus. Look at that. Oh, wow. He's got a big ass sword for it, too. Yeah. Uh, do you have any sense of just, uh, you know, how much do you, is this, do you think that this is about as much content as the base game, or is it like, you know, a third? This is probably about half okay. as right. much, I'm guessing, so, um... And is it, like, significantly harder, or it, is it... It certainly can be, yeah, especially, you know, when you start off, because you you haven't really been gearing for, you know, fights with ice that much. Oh, sure, yeah. Um, and most of the monsters right away, you know, have to participate in, you know, the Horfrost Reach. Uh, they, they do, however, you know, give you a bunch of missions to, to do um, back in the old areas. A bunch of new monsters pop oh. up there. Huh. You hungry? Always. We got a new cook. Let's, money. Let's mm. just go with this here. Yeah. What's up, Grandma? I appreciate that they just have all the same stuff, but with different animations. Right. That works. It's not done yet. That was not ready. Mm -hmm. Okay, now we're ready. That looks all right. Look at this. Jeez. Oh, they just fell off. It's falling off the. Well, it's not even bone. I guess it's more it's like, a yeah. stick or something. Yeah. Looking good. Have you seen my cute ass calico? So uh, this, this is Cal. Uh huh. Uh, she's a uh, palico. Do you have uh, new options for new There's types some, of palicos? Or yeah, you do you actually have some some new models for both the the hunter and uh, and your your palico. Okay. And what's nice is they give you a voucher to to kind of swap if you, you want to change it around. Yep. Okay. Exactly. Which is which is kind of nice. Yeah. Um, I mean, yeah, because people are bringing characters in; they're not right. necessarily making new characters for this. So, so you mentioned um, you know, stuff that's. Uh, usable like right away for like somebody who's just starting out mm -hmm. uh if you buy this expansion you get a really nice set of armor and i wanted to show that off real quick because it's 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 pretty badass um hopefully i have all the stuff here yeah there we go it's called the guardian mm. set i have my layered armor on right now so i can take that off that's another thing too. That's uh, that's kind of new. Is you can. Okay, so you can have. Yep. A cosmetic set. Yep. So there we go. Yeah. What's nice about this is it gives you like 291 armor, which by comparison to like your standard leather armor, mm -hmm. is that's like 10 or 11. Uh, so this will get you through most of the the, uh, the game, and it's got some really good you know benefits yeah. as well. But. So that would be like, okay, so like if you're like, hey, I, I need to wear the armor to get me through the base content so I can get to the new stuff. That'll, you that'll do give this you the, that'll, that'll fast That'll kind of get you there. Yeah. Yeah, huh. yeah we'll use layer armor as well. That looks really good. Let's go check out uh, Horfrost Reach. Yeah. So I saw you say uh, you had like saved armored loadouts and stuff like that. That yeah. seems pretty convenient. Yeah, uh, some of the menus. Uh, so is that stuff they patched into the base game previously, or was that there? I, I don't that remember was, seeing that. Before, that was definitely but, there before. Okay. But I think they gave you more loadouts. Got it. But uh, they've also given you some some new um, options here. Uh, like boar menus this sounds daunting at first, but it's actually more convenient. Like if I want to change my layered armored settings, I'd have to go to someone specifically mm -hmm. uh, before. And now I can just do it from any item box. Okay. Um, yeah. Same thing with like changing armor, pigment, and shit like that. So cool. Little quality of life changes. Yeah. Uh, is it still the case where, like, you have you found yourself having to watch cutscenes before other players can join? Like that like, is definitely still the case. Even with this new stuff. Even with this new wow. stuff. Yeah. So they they invited us uh, to go check out. Oops. No, that's right. We're gonna do an investigation. Uh, we're gonna hunt a berry. So it's southern camp. Use a voucher. What the hell? Yeah, you got it. I mean, you got a bunch. 
So they invited us to uh, to go play um, a bunch of Monster Hunter. They gave us like you know six hours to, to mm -hmm. play that damn thing in a group, which was really nice, but also like really frustrating as well because you know not, not everybody's at the same place at the same time. So it's like okay, we have to wait for them to mm -hmm. finish their cutscene, you know, before we can actually group up. Jeez, um, it was it was kind of yeah maddening at times. That's. Uh... Uh, yeah, the sort of stuff you want them to fix, maybe that's harder to fix in an expansion than than we think. But yep. still, geez. That's, and also, yeah, I feel like the, that was like the number one. I mean, it's not insurmountable, right? But it's like right. one of the biggest complaints about Monster Hunter World was like, hey, make the it multiplayer. easier for people to get together. Mm -hmm. um, they've made you know s some small changes. You know, like the, the gathering hub. They've got like a quick access to um, like the weapons. Uh, crafter and stuff like that, so you don't have to go back outside. Uh, okay. Everything's pretty yeah. much there in the hub. So once, once you've uh, kind of picked up quests or whatever, do you need to be in this hub to take on these missions, or could you no, just like? Actually, you can yeah, do I was gonna say from anywhere. Can, yeah. Yeah, you can take on missions for you know the the regular areas from here in okay. you know, in Celiana. I don't think I'm going to finish this fight. I just wanted to show off the, the cool new area, All the right. snow tech. Same thing. Oh, we already have hot drinks. Mm -hmm. Okay, good. So we're going to need those. Let's find some hot drinks. There we go. Because otherwise, I get my ass cold. I, you don't and want it lessens that. my stamina. Okay, yeah, you don't, don't want that. Don't want that. Look at this fucking tech. Look at that. Look yeah. at those trails. Yeah, yeah. Uh, is the hot drink something you have to? Is there upkeep on that? Like every so often? Yeah. You're gonna have to pop another one. Yeah, or, just like okay. the uh, the cool drinks. And, yeah. In uh, the previous mm -hmm. like areas that were super hot. Makes sense. Yeah. This barrier gave me. Some trouble. Mm. So initially, you know, back when we... Oh shit, there's a snow shark. Of course. Beototus, look at that guy. That's not who we want to fight, though. Yeah. So, let's go this way. <laughs> I don't want to mess with him. Well, now you know where there's a Beototus for later. Oh shit! That's oh, a popo. I wanted to Mr. do popo. something. Uh. Let's see if we can survival set. Oh yeah, they've got a the survival. camera option. Oh sure. Uh, I was looking for the the raider option where you can hop on the backs of. I apparently can't do it here. In the uh, the other areas, I think you have to like you know get to a certain like affinity level for the oh, area right. before yeah. you can ride the uh, the endemic mm -hmm. like wildlife. That's that's kind of cool. Yeah. Like you can hop on the backs of these guys. <laughs> uh, and there's a new. Weapon, new classes of weapons, right? Master rank, yeah, they're all uh, much prettier, mm -hmm. uh, much, much more strong. Uh, they're they're badass, um, and you'll need to be kind of badass because these monsters are friggin' mm -hmm. tough. And then is there a there's an entirely new type of weapon as well? Is that no? That's oh, okay. Uh, no, no, it's still the same. Uh, okay, I thought they added one for the expansion or something. No, they've okay. got something called the clutch claw, which will right. Which that's will what I was through, thinking of. Okay, which is based on the uh, the slinger. Okay. Okay. Let me know if you see any tracks. That let's see. There we go. It's track there. It's track. That's a Legiana. We don't want that track. Right. Well, didn't specify you wanted new tracks. I right. That's a little leggy on Oh. Hi. See ya. Hmm. Gonna find him somewhere. This is an investigation, so he's not always in the, uh... In the same spot. Mm hmm Fuck. You think it could just go well once for a for No, a why would I, you know. God oh, damn it. Why start now? Okay. Come on. Oh, there's a bloody, uh, fuck that guy. 
think I'll lay down. Saw ya. This doesn't seem to be in the see what you're doing. This is out now, right? This is out as of today. Okay. Uh, I want to say 40 Bones. Oh, yeah. Only available... On PS4 on right now, PS, right? PS4 and Xbox. Oh, right, right. Okay. Yeah, mm. yeah that system. Here we go. Now oh, we're on the trail. So, unfortunately, the uh, PC version is not going to be out until January 2020. That's, uh... That's some bullshit. This was this was their chance to get everything kind of in step with with each version because uh, the messaging now is like you know super uh, confusing. So when they're talking about you know events that are that are going on, um, they don't always specify which platform. It is. Oh yeah. So it's like oh we're doing you know the, the crazy you know spring event or something like that and you know what it's it's not in the PC version it's only in the that's so silly. Yeah. Uh, I always felt like even even if the, the launches weren't together or whatever, like I don't know, the, the impression I got from the events wasn't that they needed to be done in a certain order or anything. It just seems like they could have started oh. whenever. They also have natural hot springs out oh, here, okay. so if you yeah. duck in him, uh -huh. you get a bonus, yeah. or you get bit by fucking bugs. That's a bonus, depending on you yeah. know which bug, what the bug does. Right. Could be a, one of those good bugs. I'm sure there's some out there. I've never met them. Uh, oh, for fuck's sake. Seriously? I think you lost the trail there. I think so, too. Let's circle around. No. Circle around this way. So with the Master, master Rank stuff, they actually have Master Rank for, like, all of the... Well, 90% of the uh, um, armor that was available before, and it's got sometimes a new look to it, yeah. um, and that goes for the weapons cool. as well. So you get start getting like Master Rank Rathaloses you know, pretty early mm -hmm. on, so you'll be able to craft new Master Rank Rathalos armor. Huh. Armor. It's going to be the one. There we go! We're on the hunt. All right. Yeah. Pin that guy. Take me to where I need to go, Scout Flies. You're so beneficial. Just... No other big like, quality of life improvements mm -hmm. like the Scout Flies. Not on that level. Oh, fuck, there he is. All right. Stalling. Yeah. Uh, oh, wait. Jolly mantle. They have some new mantles and stuff. Oh, okay. Like yeah. a yeah. You know, nice, you know, ice one. Which is pretty handy for, like, look at this one. Nice monster. Oh, shit. Keep checking. Yeah, I guess I hadn't considered that it maybe was a little weird that they, uh, you know, the expansion is based around one element. Right. I'm concerned just how elemental the rest of the game is. Yeah. And that'll give you kind of, I don't know, somewhat of an indication as to how much content there is. I don't yeah. know, that, that might be misleading. Uh, there are a, a big roster of, you know, like returning characters that this Barry has here. Um, yeah. Not in the last game, but he's been in previous games. Oh, shit. Cool. Here. Yeah. Big ice here, you know, between this and you know, Gears 5. Oh, really? The, the, well, not all of Gears 5, but a big chunk of the middle is ice. This guy's actually a really fun fight. He's so fast, yeah. and he'll, he'll chase you down, so it's really hard um, to like use items in this fight. Well, that's why you go in with someone else, and then they can... Yeah. Well, speaking of that, um, 
there's a new difficulty level. Before it was just scaled to like, you know, four people. Yeah. Um, even if you had two. Uh, right. Which, which yeah. was actually. But uh, now they've given you know, two player difficulty level, which is nice. Cool. Uh, those fights are nice because you you also get to bring palicos. Oh yeah. Uh, yeah. Oops. Should charge right now. <laughs> we didn't need to sit there. For yeah. yeah. Load times still seem uh, yeah, a yeah, little rough. Yeah, a little rough on, on the... Uh, if you haven't put in like an SSD, um, they are about the same on both you know the PS uh, base model and the Pro. Mm -hmm. They're excruciating. Yeah. I've gone onto PC and that's my main platform now. Um, and yeah. The loading times are just like completely negligible. Mm -hmm. It's so much nicer. It's just, I think that makes the, the weird delay even more frustrating. Yep. Well, it's not, not that it's a weird delay. I mean, that's what they did with the base game, too. It's just. Yeah. Yeah. All right. I'll shove the uh, the clutch cloud before we go. Th right. That's that's uh, the main like new thing I think that's uh, worth talking about. I didn't use it in that fight, but hmm. let's see. We're gonna post a new quest. We're just gonna go through the uh, the tutorial here. Um, I don't want master rank though. It should be an optional quest. There we go. Learning the clutch. Accept this quest. Time. And then we wait. All right. We can go eat again. Might as well. But Grandma. I normally kind of look through all of the skills that they give you depending on the, the right. fight. Yeah. There's some uh, like a, like a boxing a skill with that. Uh, well, like it's so like if you faint one time, you don't get penalized. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, yeah, super nice. I like the way that meat moves when she touches it. it there's some jiggle there. Yeah. Boink. Oh yeah. You can cow get some. Mm-hmm. Oh, you're. Oh jeez. Making a dang mess. The clutch claw is basically uh, a grappling hook that you can use to latch onto monsters. You know, in the, mm -hmm. the previous game, you'd have to like jump off a ledge, get some height, land on the monster. Yeah, I was, uh, let's call it rotten at, at doing that. At mounting monsters. Yeah, and it was completely inconsistent, you know, depending on you know, when you last did it, you might not be able to do it again. Clutch claw with your weapon. All right. Over the basics first. I don't have any game audio, so I gotta. Oh, you don't? Okay. I do. You can let me know. Anyway, I'll shoot. And you can do this uh, with your weapon out as well, which is That's nice. It. Nice work. There we go. Fire nice work. With your weapon drawn mm -hmm. as well. Try drawing your weapon cool. before firing the clutch. Right. It's not very long, though. Yeah. We'll have something come out here shortly, I think. Now, pull, you got, I think you got, oh, probably okay. gotta pull out your weapon and. And then fire it with the weapon out first to check that other one off. There you go. Oh, shot. Each weapon handles slightly differently, so make sure to put in enough time with each weapon to get fully accustomed. Let's move on. All of the uh, the weapons have some sort of new feature a as well. With your clutch mm -hmm. plot like a, with the bow, for example, that's one of my first main weapons. The weapon attacks you they had the uh, the dragon the strike. Uh huh. The type of attack depends um, on which weapon And now they've got like a big shotgun blast. Mm -hmm. Essentially, you can fire all of your uh, slinger ammo. Okay. Right yeah. into their Before fucking face. Yeah, that sounds alright. Get the exact same thing. Oh, should I pick this up? So pay yeah. Attention. yeah. All right, now you got a monster stomping around. A tough time landing an attack while clinging on. Attack the oh, monster it's, first it's to make a glitch. It's coming. It's coming. It stops, yeah. Hit it where it hurts. Okay. There you go. There you go. Pull this off in practice. Pay close attention to monsters' movements and land your. I don't know. Just like that. Wow. Oh. 
to the first to make it flinch, and once it stops, hit so it the benefit to that is there, that I'm actually there. making Grab that like weak spot now. Oh, huh. but don't sweat it. Just focus on attacking it again. But different weapons behave differently depending on which attack that you're doing. Mm -hmm. yeah. I did grapple onto the monster. What do you want? Yeah, I thought you did too. Maybe you didn't mount it, mount it. You were just on it for a sec. Oh, shit. Yeah. Go from a grapple to a weapon attack. There we go. So yeah, there's several different things that you can do. Yeah. Nice you see that it sends them flying as well, uh -huh. which is nice. Broke some parts. Yeah. There's only certain times that you can grapple onto it, but you'll you'll get a feel for it. Uh -huh. Like, you know, if they're moving okay. around too much, we're gonna try to hit you can't do it. If they're enraged, you can't do it. It depends on the monster, but there are usually several body parts you can cling on to. You can move to different parts of the monster's body while clinging on to it, but you'll consume a lot of stamina. Make sure to get your aim right before going for a particular body part. You'll need slinger ammo. Go find some and load up. Attack the monster first to make it flinch. Just want to grapple to a flinch shot. Hit it where it hurts. Dollar two. Now, use your slinger. Oh. <laughs> that sends them really reeling. Yeah. So the benefit to that is that you can knock them into traps. Oh, cool. Yeah. Let's move on. Um, and I think the the next tutorial will, will show us that we can actually like lead the monster as well while we're grappled onto it. Wow. You can use this attack when clinging onto a monster's head. Attack the monster first to make it flinch, and once it stops, hit it where. It so this does actually change up the the fights pretty. Dynamically, like uh, especially if you're using traps, uh -huh. they can be super beneficial. Yeah, I mean, I, I you know, as someone who didn't necessarily play a ton of this game, like I shied away from traps a lot of the time just because I couldn't see control him, them. See enough. Him turning it yeah, around. yeah. This is that way. A lot of stamina, but it allows you to make the monster change direction in quick succession. Uh oh, looks like the monster is getting angry. When enraged, you won't be able to knock back monsters or get them to change course. Sense. Any monster becomes a threat if they're angry enough. Keep a close watch. When angry, monsters will be a lot more aggressive, so it's best to keep it oh, Jeez. That feels real good. Yeah. Looks like it's calmed down. Let's move on. <laughs> Right, now let's put everything you've learned so far into practice. This attack makes use of your surroundings. Fire your slinger while clinging onto the monster's head and make it slam into the walls. There we go. This will be a great opportunity to really wail on the monster. This is your time to shine. Uh, to the left. Uh, there you go. There he is. Do you see how I was going from like his? Uh... Yeah, yeah. Seems like it takes a ton of stamina to move around. Shit. Looks like you strayed too far from the wall. Don't worry. Just try it again. Just calm down. You need ammo to fire your slinger. You don't have ammo. Try this one more time. Need some stones. 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 Oh, you son of a bitch. All right. Did I knock him into the wall? He, no. He ah, is. fuck it. Yeah. Get me out of here. Well, we get the idea. Yeah, we get the idea. It's it's really cool. Um, yeah, that's that's neat. Like being able to arguably, kind of directly manipulate the monster a little more. Arguably the best part of like combat in Monster Hunter Hunter is like, you know, the biggest like thrill moments I think is when you mount a monster. Mm -hmm. um, I think it's pretty neat. This is also new. You can do a take all, but actually I really like just holding on to the button. <laughs> <clears throat>
I'll show off a little bit of the armor. Not too much. All right. That's yeah, I mean, that's, that's kind of the game. You know? Yeah. But there's some really good stuff. I'll just show off some early stuff. If we ever get out of this loading. Oh my god. <laughs> I mean, that's. <laughs> yeah, it's. It's indicative of how much I like the game that I'm still willing to put up with this mm -hmm. to keep. Instead playing. of just waiting until January. Right. Um, I'm having a really good time with it. Like I really like the roster of monsters. Cool. They, they brought back some of my some of my favorites. Let's see. Oh, we gotta go to. I got everything in Selena. I got an Elder Melder. Okay, so yeah, you you could just play the game from here. Totally. Yeah. This guy came along. Yeah. That was a pretty nice one. Forge some armor. A regular ass bone armor. Mm -hmm. There we go. That way. No real secrets here. Yeah. Let's uh, get down to the. Here we go. Now we're starting. That was yeah. just a cape. Yeah. Um, pookie. There's lots of new variants too, like the Coral Pookie Pookie, which is. One of the more fun fights, uh, he shoots like a water stream out of his <laughs> tail, nice. which is kind of gross. Yeah. Well. Yeah. There we go. That's what I wanted. Cool. To show off. Yeah. It's like some John Snow, like a sexy John Snow. Mm-hmm. That changes up a little bit with the with the beta. All right. Yeah. Yeah. That's hot new looks. Yep. That's really good too. I think it's about it though. You know, like I said, uh, even with the load times and everything, I'm still really enjoying the game. This adds a lot of content. Mm -hmm. uh, the master rank, I want to say, goes up to, I hope it's not a huge spoiler, but I want to say it goes up to like level five, which should be a pretty good indicator of you know, how much content is, Got it. is yeah. in the game. Um, or at least give you a, a rough idea, mm -hmm. anyway. Um, let's see. They give you that guardian armor right away if you want to, you know, get your ass up to level 16 so you can play the content yeah uh that's going to be a huge help uh but other than that yeah this is this has been a a, a treat yeah nice <laughs> uh you know previous games they always you know sold this separately uh it's nice that it's just an add-on instead add of uh, having to get ultimate or g rank you know, yeah exactly all your monster hunter g's yep and you'll still yeah. be able to play with people that are on um, you know, the previous oh, sure. game right. as well. You don't, yeah. Don't. And you can bring your fancy armor into their game. Yep. Okay, yeah. Yeah, should That be. makes sense. All right. Got to show off that armor and get them to buy the thing. That's... After, after all. That is Monster Hunter Iceborne. Cool. Thanks, Say goodbye Jason. to my Cal. Yeah, looking, looking good. Cal. Calico, looking Calico. Good. Look at his backpack. I mean, the backpack's a cat also. That's, that's, that's just, just silly. Well, that's pretty cute. You should get an Instagram account for that cat. They do well. Thanks, Jeff. Thanks, Jason.